I'm more of a having a good time type of guy. Oh, <laughs> I don't even damn. know what women do for fun. Just fucking fold shit or something like that. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Look, I All right, so we are back doing some more comedy in which we are featuring Shane Gillis. And this piece is called Isis and Girlfriend. Okay, all right. Well, uh, let's random. go ahead. Yeah, that is random. Let's go ahead and bring this display up. Guys, leave your thoughts in the comment section. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. I'll tell you this, on a more serious note, <laughs> this is something I'm dealing with I in my life. Right. I, just, I recently found out that the girl I'm dating, her ex is a Navy SEAL. Okay. That sucks. <laughs> that sucks dick, dude. That's the worst ex of all time. I never even thought of it. You want to feel insecure as a man? That's oh. the word. I never, nice. never even thought of that one as like, that could happen to me. I spent my man. whole life thinking, black guy, worst case on this. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, I mean that with all due respect to the black community, dude. For real, I wish people feared my dick like that. <laughs> I, w I wish my dick struck fear into entire races. <laughs> Nobody no. fears my dick, dude. Nobody fears my dick. <laughs> Other than like women in parking garages, they. <laughs> oh, oh! You get me in a parking no. garage, all of a sudden my dick's top of the food chain. Hell no! See me lurking behind a pillar in there. Just... Those garages are scary. Yeah. Just with a GameStop bag. Just... <laughs> <laughs> nah, dude, Navy Seal. It's a tough one. I do this thing. It's not a good thing, but whenever. Whenever I'm dating a girl, I always talk shit on her exes. Mm. It's not a good look. Women don't yeah. respect it. it kind of makes me look like a bitch. Hell no. I like it. I, <laughs> <laughs> I can't stop doing it. And normally it's easy. Normally it's like, what's your ex do? He's a fucking substitute teacher. It's weird he wants to hang out with kids. like, that bad. You know, I'm like, <laughs> this one's tough. This is a tough ex to make fun of. Just when I'm walking around the apartment all day, just <laughs> Fucking Navy SEALs. <laughs> They're kind of pussies if you really think about it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like using night vision, sneaking up on guys. That's a fucking coward's way to fight, dude. You know who's actually brave? Al Qaeda. Oh. <laughs> that takes courage and bravery. <laughs> Damn. Pajamas, throwing rocks at tanks. <laughs> Heroic shit, dude. Just you and your boys going out. In flip-flops, you're all gonna get fucked up. <laughs> no training. Zero military training, dude. Those guys, those dudes, they had fucking, they had one set of monkey bars. That's what they all trained on. <laughs> this dude, he takes like the craziest topics and he yeah. just makes them hilarious. Yeah. Dang. Nobody wants to hear about their ex-boyfriend. So like, right. if you are in a relationship and maybe he, the person you're with ask about your ex, you don't want to keep talking about right. it. Right, yeah, 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 but <laughs> Jesus. Kind of they were proud of the monkey bars. You remember that video? You've seen them using the monkey bars. They were proud. They, remember that. They yeah. filmed themselves using the monkey bars and then sent that tape out to the world like, not bad. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I can do. A buddy of mine watches like uh, like death videos on the internet. Mm. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> he watches them. If we're hanging out, I'll watch. We watch. I, watch. <laughs> I was over at his place. We were watching. I don't know if you know this. The war in the Middle East is just on the internet. The whole fucking thing. Every dude out there on both sides was wearing yeah. GoPros the entire time. Like you can watch it. We watched like three hours of the war in Iraq. And after the first hour, I found myself starting to cheer, not cheer, but like, <laughs> Damn. Relate. I felt like I could relate more to the monkey bars guys. You know what I mean? They were a little more my speed. You ever wonder how you would do out there? Watch those guys. Oh. Those are just normal fucking dudes. Oh. Second shots are fired. There's no game plan. Everyone's like, oh shit. Oh. <laughs> Very relatable, guns jamming. Damn. Trying to fire a rocket, it goes straight fucking backwards. <laughs> They're very, they look like me, trying to fire a gun. Their feet move when they shoot. <laughs> very relatable. They also have never won. They, ne oh. they got fucked up every single time. Bad. They would blow up like one truck every five months. They'd be just as surprised as everybody. 
this shit finally worked out. You could hear it in their voice. Someone blow up, they'd be like, oh! Like, yeah, dude, that's a human reaction. That's relatable. That's what I would do if I saw a fucking explosion. I'd go, oh! That's human. You ever watch us kill people? I can't relate to that at all. There's some Black Hawk helicopter with night vision, mows down like 40 people. The pilot gets on, he just goes, clear. Just fucking, just flies away. It's like, yo, that's a psycho. That guy didn't give a fuck about that. At least ISIS is down there having fun, dancing afterwards. Oh. I feel like we should be laughing at Oh, man. You know? I know, like, right? You village down He's there, talking about know? death and destruction. We crack it up. Can you take it back a little bit? Yeah. Village. Oh. At least ISIS is down there having fun, dancing afterwards. <laughs> you know? It's like Ewok Village down there, you know? Oh, oh. <laughs> also, I'm not, I'm not actually pro-ISIS. <laughs> right? It's just, you gotta maybe she'll be fuck my girlfriend. Sorry. 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 Right? Sorry. Also, I'm not, I'm not actually pro-ISIS. <laughs> All right, it's just a Navy SEAL did fuck my girlfriend. <laughs> and I am having a pretty tough time dealing with that. It sucks, dude. Yeah. Can't get it out of my head. <laughs> Some hard. fucking cool, jacked hero. Just getting tactical on my sweet baby's pussy. Oh my God, why are you thinking about that? Just clearing out every corner of my sweet angel's box. Damn. Oh, just checking okay. behind every door in there. Just clear, go. Red team, advance. Oh, so cringe. Now I'm in there fucking. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was funny. I know we're laughing and having a good time, but for real, that does suck. That sucks. <laughs> that absolutely sucks. Sexually? Sexually, I have to, I have to follow a fucking Navy SEAL. They never quit until the job's done, dude. That's their whole thing. I quit a lot, all right? <laughs> the job's done when I'm tired, which is usually pretty early into the mission. <laughs> My arms start shaking pretty early. They give out. Next thing you know, we're having belly-to-belly -belly missionary. <laughs> Just hunched over, breathing in her ear like a pug for five minutes. <laughs> Just coughing. Coughing during sex is funny. Just... <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, you guys know belly to belly missionary, dude. Don't fucking. I saw this crowd, dude. I oh. see you, boy. A lot of belly belly tonight, dude. This guy's hunched over. Just... <sighs> you don't even think about that noise you're making in that poor woman's ear. Every woman in this room has heard that noise. You've never thought it. The only way I can describe it is like, you ever lay down and a dog starts sniffing your ear? That's what it sounds like. Every just. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, they said. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's not over. Yeah, they said after the, uh, after the thing, there's more. Fine. Oh, that was so funny. This dude, he is wild. Yeah. Where did this guy come from? I don't know, but thinking about who your girlfriend was with before you mm -hmm. is is a bad idea. Yeah. Because yeah. you're you're with her now, and that's all right. that yeah. matters. But I, I don't know how he's able to take like these situations and just make them so funny. Yeah. Like I mean, oh he's really God. concerned. I can yeah. tell. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he is hilarious. <laughs> No, my girlfriend and I, we have sex, and it's fine. <laughs> it's okay. One thing that's funny about, though, is uh, it's a new enough relationship that my girlfriend's still loud during sex. You remember that? You remember that phase? It's still new enough in the relationship that my girlfriend, like, screams every time we have sex, and I'm just up there like, yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, right, lady. I've seen women walk through this, no problem. Oh, I mean, it's, nice. it's a nice gesture. And sometimes it tricks me, sometimes I'm like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, maybe it's not gonna fit. <laughs> no, it's gonna fit. It's gonna fit. It's gonna fall out a couple times. <laughs> oh my God. 
No, the screaming, the screaming phase is about done. We moved in together, so that's when that, that's when that ends. Once you, before you live together, sex is like, yeah, fuck me, me. <laughs> Once you move in together, sex slowly becomes just some lady laying on a bed next to a pile of unfolded laundry, just... just <laughs> You're on my head. <laughs> no, we live together now. My girlfriend moved in with me, so we have sex. And uh, as soon as we're done having sex, I wish that she would fucking evaporate. <laughs> oh, wow. Damn. No? I would, no, you guys are right. I hate playing Xbox by myself, dude. <laughs> Yeah, it's crazy. He's ready for his girl to go so he can play video. Fuck. I love having her around all the time. <laughs> Fucking turn it on lights. That's funny. Asking me to hang out. No. <laughs> no, we hang out. I'm just not used to it. I'm not used to I'm not used to hanging out with a woman all the time. I'm not used to hanging out with women. I don't have any female friends. I'm more of a having a good time type of guy. <laughs> Oh, I don't even damn. know what women do for fun. Just fucking fold shit or something like that. Wait. Huh? <laughs> Look, I know that's not the best joke of all time. From your seats, that's not the most well-crafted joke. What do women do? Fold shit? But from up here, from up here, it's a very, very funny joke. I get to say something as dumb as, what do women do? Fold shit? And then look out and see about 15 different women going, <laughs> I understand Aww. most of the women here are girlfriends that were dragged to this show <laughs> that already don't really like me because every time they're in their car their boyfriend's like baby baby listen to this part of the podcast <laughs> yeah I'm aware alright so once again that was absolutely hilarious yeah, was Shane hilarious. Gillis is funny as a woman how did you feel about his jokes I, I thought it was funny, mm -hmm. but it, it made me think, because mm -hmm. I don't really talk about any of my exes like that, so mm -hmm. you wouldn't have enough information to know what they did for a yeah. living or think about them or yeah. anything of that nature. I, I sl talked slick, like the other day, I mentioned one of your exes and I said some slick shit. It went in one ear and out yeah. the other, because I don't even remember. <laughs> I don't that's, even remember. Well, that's that's good. That's good. But uh, as I said, you know, Shane Gillis, he's able to take certain situations and make them absolutely hilarious. And I, I, I can understand how women, like, he could be a guy's comedian. And so that's why I was kind of gauging you as a woman, like, hearing him. Mm -hmm. Like, how did you think of what did you I think thought it was his funny. Comedy? Even okay. though folding laundry jokes yeah, was yeah, funny. Yeah, yeah. Or um, wanting her to evaporate after sex is yeah. like. Damn, that's messed up. Yeah. But at the same time, I thought it was funny because when you're in a relationship and you're together all the time, yeah. it's like, eh, sometimes you do want your personal space. So oh, really? He, 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 really? You want me to evaporate? Babe, you have a whole basement to I yourself. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, uh, we'd love to continue to do some more Shane Gillis. So if you have any suggestions, uh, let us know down below in the comment section. But also, let us know what you thought about this comedy special as well. As I said earlier, Shane Gillis is slowly becoming my absolute favorite comedian, and I would love to see more of his work. Anyway, guys, we're getting up out of here. Like, share, and subscribe. We'll see y'all next time. Take care. Peace. Yeah.